Hello and welcome to Mock Productions, you're here with me, Matthew, and we are back for the second Transforming Tuesday. So, in front of me I do have a box, however, we're going to get to this last. I wanted to do a collection update <clears throat> in terms of all the robots in disguise figures that I have right in front of me. So, you remember some of these from the unboxings and everything, some have been taken out and have been transformed differently and everything like that, but we'll just go through them, check them out, and uh, see what we've got. So, there's the first one, which is that, that's the Bumblebee from the two-pack with Underbite, you can see both of them there, obviously in the box they were transformed into their actual robot forms, so there's those two. Then you've got Megatronus here. That's another one. Um, we've also got the Optimus Prime in the white deco, uh, which came with Megatronus. Obviously, you can see this one has been transformed uh, to be in the truck form. Uh, we also got Fix It. Let's fix it there. Looking really, really cool. Uh, Megatronus has had too much squash. But um, yes. Fix It is a really cool figure. He goes very well with all of the uh, Warrior figures, which is a really, really cool thing to have. Um, the Wave Ones. Now, if my brain does not mess me around here, the Wave Ones were Legion uh, Strongarm, got the normal Optimus Prime, we've got Steel Jaw here. We've also got the normal Bumblebee. So that was Wave 1. These were obviously the Clash of the Transformers. Um, Fix It came into Wave 3. Um, wave 2 was Sideswipe and Grimlock. Looking really cool. And Unbalanced, because why not? Why not have an Unbalanced Dinosaur? He's been on the squash with Megatronus. And then, of course, in Wave 3, we also had Underbite. This is the regular-looking Underbite, looking really, really cool. So we'll place him in between all of them. So in terms of Legions, that's all of the Legions I have. Um, now, there's one, two, three, four, five. There's five more at the moment, which I'm planning on getting. Now, um, four of which are out at the moment, and one, which I'm not going to spoil anything, was announced very, very recently, and it's looking really, really cool. It's a Decepticon, I will tell you that, but um, he's looking really, really cool. Can't wait to actually see what he looks like in Legion form and how he actually transforms. That's going to be pretty interesting. So we have, obviously, all of these. So let's just move this back slightly. Um, we've got a wave... I've got two Wave 1 Warriors. Now, I haven't gone crazy with the Warriors, because I kind of like all the Legions. But we've got Warrior Steeljaw here. Now, he's he's a little bit of a pain to stand. Let me just tilt this up slightly so you can actually see. There we go. He's a little bit of a pain to stand. His tail is actually used to make him stand. Um, we've also got, I had to get this guy, it was the actual first figure I got actually, which was Warrior Grimlock. He is super awesome. So that's all them. Got two Steel Jaws, two Grimlocks at the moment. Um, so you'll also recognise these guys. So we got Megatronus there, looking really, really cool. Got Thunderhoof on the side there. We've also got this dude, which is definitely my favourite, which is Quillfire, looking super, super cool. With his gun and his quill on his back, really awesome. And recently I went out um, with my... <laughs> from my previous channel, I had a cameraman. Um, he, he, uh, he would uh, help me with the camera whilst I'm reviewing the figures, because obviously sometimes it does get a little bit hard to move the camera every now and again and know how you're looking in terms of when you're transforming them and everything. Um, we went out, we did a bit of um, scouting around for different bits and bobs, trying to fill in all the blanks, especially for these guys. Um, and I ended up actually buying this guy, which is Warrior Fracture, and I have to say he is super awesome. He's really, really cool. Um, I was planning on just picking him up online, but it was like a ridiculous price, and I was very, very surprised to actually see him where I saw him. Um, so we got him, and we also, which I didn't think I'd even start collecting these guys, but they are actually super cool. 
We've got two mini cons here. We've got Slipstream and Dive Bomb. Now, to get their other, if you've seen the actual show, to get their other counterparts, you have you have to buy the deployers, which is a deployer of Fracture and a deployer of Drift. Now, I'm not planning on getting them, so hopefully, I might be able to pick these up online. Um, not not these in particular, but their other forms, because I, I'd rather have you know the two pairs rather than these two separate ones. But you can see here they do scale rather well. I'd say they just need to shrink just like a smidgen, just like a smidgen more, a little bit smaller, and they'd be perfect. Now, obviously, when you uh, when you actually do these, because they do slightly transform for the deployer form, I'll just show you this. You get this sort of missile thing. All this plastic translucent stuff can come off. But the whole point of this one in particular is this is one of Fracture's uh, missiles and you can actually see the two missiles just in his shoulder pads. Uh, it's not going to fit in there. For the, for the actual robot form, it works perfect. It absolutely works perfect um, and is almost a perfect uh, sort of scale. Um, but uh, I'm, I'm happy with these and I might actually have to pick up more because uh, the new series just started, when was it? I think it was yesterday in some countries, the day before in others. And it had these cyclones. There's also been little um, mini episodes. They had cyclones, and they're basically like little um, balls. Let's just put it that way. They are basically ball transformers. And there's this one transformer which actually pairs up with them, puts them into his hands, and then he can use them. Um, I think one's what is called backtrack and ransack. You'll probably be able to um, search them up and see what they look like. But they are super super cool. So that is my collection at present. Um, so let's. I'm going to rearrange this, and we'll be back in two seconds. Okay, so we have all the figures rearranged, and we have the box in front of us now. As you can, as you can probably tell already by the title, and if you've read the description, it should have told you. But um, this will increase the amount of transformers we have for this collection. So let's open it up and see which ones we have in here. It's a little small box, so I'm hoping that people might be able to think, I know what's in here. <clears throat> Could it be small transformers? Well, it might be. You know, you never know. There's a bit of um, fluff there. But inside the box, we have Autobot Drift and we have Thunderhoof. Now we've already got Thunderhoof, he's right there, but as a warrior, and I had to get him in the Legion, he is looking pretty sweet. Drift is an extremely neon orange colour. Um, he's so, so cool. This is looking really, really cool, the actual uh, Transformer there. You can see five steps, looking really cool, and you can scan him in the app actually, which is really, really cool, and the, the code is actually on the side there. Um, and obviously you can see Thunderhoofs is right there in front. Um, now basically, I, I, let's, let's go through the app actually. Basically what this app does is you scan these transformers every single day and it'll actually give you crystals. So any codes, every single one has a little itty bitty code, itty bitty code everywhere on them if they're transformed. Um, <laughs> but um, they'll give you the code, you go on and it will actually, I don't think it unlocks the character because you have to use jewels in the game. I've, I've messed around with the game and it is, it is, it's rather cool. Um, just wish it was slightly, slightly better. Maybe, you know, if they actually made a proper game of it, you know, that'd be really awesome. Um, but yes, that was what was in the box. We have Autobot Drift and we have Thunderhoof here. Won't be unboxing these, but we will be, I'll be making um, some sort of videos in terms of like reviews and everything. I used to do that on the other channel. Um, <clears throat> so we'll have to, I don't know whether I'm going to do it in like waves um, or just separate videos, but obviously Transformers Tuesday will be one week down. So next, the week coming, um, the next Tuesday, let's just put it that way, um, there won't be any Transformers Tuesday, uh, there'll be a new series taking place for the whole entire week, um, and I cannot wait to get started on that because it's looking really, really cool. But Transformers Tuesday will come back. But in the meantime, comment down below how you'd like to see these sort of shown off. Would you like to see a review 
on, you know, a wa the whole wave, you know, maybe there's a wave of legions, I might do it for the legions, because obviously, one little transform and that's it, that's going to be very short, but let me know how you want to see these, I might do that actually, um, but yes, there we go, awesome stuff, we got these two in the boxes, can't wait to open these up and add them to co the, the, to the collection in front of me, uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 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 20 figures. Oh, and plus these, 22. So there's 22 figures in all, right in front of me. Really cool. Really happy with this. So there we go, guys. Thanks for watching. If you have enjoyed, make sure to hit that subscribe button below for more Transforming Tuesdays. And guess what day that is? <gasps> it's on Tuesday. Well done. <laughs> Uh, you can also comment down below, like I've said, and any right in front of you right here, maybe you don't have them, or maybe you're, you, uh, you have a specific favourite out of all of these in front of you, let me know in the comments below, and also rate the video so I know you're enjoying the unboxings and the Transformers Tuesday series, thanks very much for watching, I'll see you guys next time, thank you, and goodbye.